810 now, a new on AM Extra. We're unraveling what's behind the rise of gray divorce. So it's not necessarily a type of divorce, but mm. more so the question of who is divorcing. Data shows rates are skyrocketing among aging Americans. Joining us on the couch to tell us more about gray divorce and why it's happening is local certified life and divorce coach, Lara Brunstrom. Good morning. Good morning. Thanks for being here. Awesome to be here. I'd never heard of the term a, a gray divorce. So what exactly are we referring to here? So we're referring to anybody 50 and over who's mm -hmm. getting divorced. Mm -hmm. So it's it's rising. It's risen about 105% in the last wow. yeah, a lot. Yeah. <laughs> a lot. A lot happening in that area. What is the reason for that? Can we pinpoint that? Uh there's a lot of reasons. Um empty nest you know, mm. oh my gosh, I have to, wait, we're spending this much time together? Right. We're like, what's happening here? <laughs> Who are we without our kids <laughs> in the house? All, the all these are distractions the are gone. Yeah. Interesting. Um, yeah. We're living longer. Mm -hmm. So if you're facing, if you're at 50 or 60 and you're facing 30 more years, um, do I, do, do we like each other enough yeah. to be spending 30 more years in huh. a space where we're not particularly happy? Interesting. That is fascinating. There are some interesting statistics, too, when we break this down. I think we, we had a few that we can talk about here. When you look at the statistics of a gray divorce uh, and, and who is involved, I was surprised it's more than a third of all divorces, mm -hmm. um, a, a lot of them being initiated by women. That was kind of surprising to me. Yeah, it edges a little bit more towards women, about 66%. Okay. It's not massive. I reached out to a few of the law firms that I work with locally and just kind of asked them to compare, like, give me some of your information that you're seeing with your clients. Mm -hmm. And they, they follow the statistics, the national statistics pretty well. Mm -hmm. um, a few more women, and I think that's because women are more financially secure than they have been. Mm. Hmm. It, it just, the, the numbers are fascinating uh, behind it. And even just the lifespan side of that, that's also interesting. Um, if this is something, again, you are a divorce coach. Yes. If you are working with somebody who is maybe on the fence of something like this or going through the process, what is something that somebody going through a great divorce may need to know. Educate yourself. Mm. Know that you were talking about armrests earlier. Mm -hmm. So if you think of in divorce in your 30s, you have a long runway to land. So you've got all the time in the world and gray divorce is going to shrink you down to like landing on an aircraft carrier mm. where you better hope that hook hooks because your your span to finish this mm -hmm. is shorter. So yeah. if you need to ramp up a career, it's less time. So if you true. have one pie of money to divide and you're going to Thanksgiving dinner, all of a sudden you're taking a half a pie mm. to Thanksgiving dinner. Mm -hmm. So you're everything split and what you thought your retirement was going to look like is now financially probably half. Mm. So considering that going forward, so knowing before you decide, you know, are, is it reconcilable? Is this fixable? It's almost always communication is at the base of everything mm -hmm. <laughs> that goes sideways. Mm -hmm. Can you fix that? If not, and you want to move forward, get your certified divorce financial analyst. Get a coach that you can work with that is confidential and not going to gossip and spread all the rumors. Like mm. make those decisions, what I call a whole body decision. Your mind, your gut, your heart, everything in line to have no regrets. So if you go forward with this, your future is going to look a lot different mm -hmm. right, than what you planned. It's interesting. Yeah, we do see with adults later in life, you know, it's it's never too late to put yourself first, obviously, mm -hmm. but there are some very different financial considerations uh, when you're at that stage of the game and a little yes. closer to retirement. Well, it's it's all great things to think about. We appreciate you being here. Loved being here. Great discussion. Thank you. Certified life and divorce coach, Lara Brunstrom. If you're interested in some personal or divorce coaching, you can check out our website, sterlingfirecoaching.com.